Hi, I'm Matt. And I'm Dave. And welcome to the Cross Border Trade in Plain English course. Now, you're not going to believe selling internationally on eBay with Magento and M2E Pro is unbelievably easy. <laughs> I bet some of you are expecting us to say difficult, challenging, but no, it really is super easy. Yeah, unbelievably easy. Now, if you've sold any products on eBay using Magento and M2E Pro, then it's that easy. It is unbelievably easy how to do this in Magento and M2E Pro. No matter what you've heard or rumors or anything like that or been told by another software provider, it is so easy to do in Magento and M2E Pro and you're gonna find out how in this video course. Now, Dave, we're going to learn quite a lot together during this course, aren't we? We are. You're going to learn how to leverage cross-border trade the easy way. And we really do mean the easy way. And you're going to find out about that in the next video tutorial. We're then going to show you how to get started by adding in the additional Magento store views and currencies that you're going to be needing. And along with any additional settings which you need to know about. And again, you're learning from our mistakes. We've been there and done this with Magento and M2E Pro. And we're going to set you up and get you set up the right way so you don't run into odd messages around currencies. Because that's the one which caught me out. <laughs> and speaking of currencies, Matt, when it comes to the pricing attributes in Magento, we're going to show you the way that both myself and Matt would do if we were sellers like yourself. And it's the way that gives you maximum control over the price of your products internationally. That's right. And that's going to be a common theme when this entire course is giving you maximum and also granular control over your international selling activities on eBay. And on that note, we're also going to be enabling not just one, but two sites in M2E Pro. So that's international eBay sites specifically eBay Australia and eBay Germany, because we might as well choose a tough one, well, two tough ones, because they're two different extra eBay sites. One's in Australian dollars, and the other one's in a completely different language, and another currency as well. And then, Matt, we're going to show you how to add in the new listing groups and policies in M2E Pro for these two new eBay sites. That's right. So we're not going to show you just one eBay site that we mentioned. We're going to show you how to do this for two. The first one, we do go a little bit slowly on, don't we, Dave? It's like a mini recap of the policies, isn't it, in m 3 Pro? Those templates which we can use. And then for the second one, which is Germany, then we pick up the pace because you've kind of seen us do it once before. And then we show you the finished article afterwards. So you know what you need to be doing and what it should look like within your Magento system. And then Dave, this last one, it's almost like a joke because it is so easy to do. We're gonna show you how to list your products onto the international eBay site. I'm, I'm saying this a bit like, it's like a bit of a joke because if you've ever listed a product onto eBay using Magento and M2E Pro, it's exactly the same process. It's so straightforward. And then finally, at the end of this course, we're gonna be including some extra tips for you to help you maximize your business when selling internationally onto the other eBay sites. There isn't, however, and this is that for this course, we are assuming just two things of you. The first is that you are already up and running and selling on eBay. And secondly, it's that you have watched the previous courses in setting up M2E Pro and Magento in your own system, because this is crucial for what we're going to be doing in this course. Yeah, there's no hanging around in this course. We really do get into the thick of it, and we do make the assumption that you've already got M2E Pro and Magento set up, and you have been and watched the previous courses. Now, if that's not you, underneath this video tutorial is that Dave's been and put the links into the getting started video tutorials for you, or video courses, should I say, and they'll get you up to a stage where you can hit this course with the ground running. Now, Dave, there is another, however, as well, which is that the tutorial which follows this one will explain to you how to sell internationally on eBay the easy way. 
Now you may have already seen this video tutorial because we did publish it a couple of weeks ago on YouTube and we know that it's had quite a few hits on there now and we'll explain to you how to sell on eBay and all the different considerations about selling internationally and some of the challenges too. Now if you have already been and watched that tutorial or you already know that the easy way of selling internationally is to just go English, whatever your native language is, to go into Australia or to go into the United States or go into the United Kingdom. If you already know that, you can skip the next video tutorial. That one's about 34 minutes long, isn't it Dave? Yeah, it's a long one, but it's a good one. <laughs> it's a good one. Okay, so if you haven't watched it, you're going to find it immensely helpful. And if you already have, happy days. You can skip straight past that one, and then we're into the practical. And that's like we mentioned, it's all plain sailing from here. So with that said, from myself, Matt. And from me, Dave. Cheerios. So from myself, Matt, and of course Dave too, we both hope that you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, we'd both really appreciate a thumbs up on YouTube, either at the top of this video or down at the bottom. So on screen right now, we have the next part of this tutorial. So if you just click on the next tutorial button, which is in the top right hand part of the screen, you'll head on over there right now. If you would like to be notified of the latest video tutorials that myself and Dave publish on YouTube, then also press the subscribe button underneath this video as well. And with that said, we'll see you in the next tutorial. Matt and Dave.